welcome back to the channel today i have an insane credit glitch for you it's a farm you spend a couple of hours here you're gonna get millions of credits it's unbelievable you do have to put some time in and there's a couple of other things you need but before we get into it make sure you hit that like button subscribe if you're new around here subscribe to my channel because i am easy now covering dpj's channel i'll link it down below but let's get into it so the first thing that you need is a power pack for your back um that has the power boost pack as you can see here right power boost pack you can get one of these in the commercial district of new atlantis in the outland shop can't miss the shop it looks all, like, all wooden just go there if he doesn't have it wait for 24 hours his inventory will re replenish i can't speak and then you will be able to buy it at some point then you want to come to the volley system and go to neon so from where alpha centauri is where we where new atlantis is which is over here um alpha centauri we go down here to the right and we go to volley and then you load into neon if you haven't been here before you'll have to go for a little introduction but if you know you're going to get there anyway because of the quest you want to go in and spawn into the neon core that's where you want to go or just neon if you've never been here before and then neon core will appear later i would suggest bringing a companion and telling the companion to wait here and trade all of your weapons and apparel and things that you want to keep onto your companion because you're going to be selling things really quickly you don't want to accidentally sell something that you want next up we're going to be doing some out of bounds jumping and glitching and you need to do this before they patch it you want to come over here to the trade authority and the thing about this boost pack is is if you use all of the boost you can jump very very high you want to jump over here like this you want to jump up here onto that you want to wait for your boost to finish replenishing in full because you need a full boost here go all the way up here i don't know what i just hit then but yeah once you have a full boost you just want to look straight up do your boost jump and move forward and catch on to this wall here it can be a little bit finicky if you're too close to the wall you'll probably hit something that's invisible so jump from about here straight up and then move forward at the last second then you want to go over this way like so oh not that high though you want to land on this here and then we're just going to run straight forwards jump through this wall onto here very very easy to do there's only really that one or maybe two difficult jumps but for the most part it's pretty simple then you want to wait for your boost to replenish again and we're going to do the same thing over this up here catch on and then we're going to drop down onto this light fixture make sure you boost right at the end because of the fact that you might break your legs then we want to walk over here because there's an invisible floor there and we're going to drop down here like this and do the boost again so we don't break our legs now we are robbing the shop stores this guy here and this guy here of their inventory which is kept under the map in chests so if we just move forwards very very slightly we can see that everything that is available from that shop is ready to be stole so we've got credits we've got ammo you're gonna have a whole bunch of ammo on you after you do this multiple multiple times and i think you can sell the ammo as well um, if you really wanted to but you're gonna get a whole bunch of weapons and the other chest has apparel and stuff to buy now a couple of these things you might want to keep and that's fine this chest you have to jump to it and press your transfer button if you miss oh if you miss wait for your boost to come back and then jump up and get it like so we can steal all of those neuro boost marks some of these you might want to keep so throw them onto your um companion while you're before you sell them now we've got everything we need there's a third chest here completely up to you if you go for it it's just the tea shop and all they have is 1500 credits it just seems a waste of time in my opinion i've already made like 10 grand just off these two chests uh, before i've even sold anything then you want to go fly back to neon core again i'm going to show you the shops to sell them in to get the most efficient way to sell because you sell things to different shops to different vendors and the only place that really sells everything to is the trade authority so the first thing you want to do is you want to run across here to the right and you want to go into the outfitters here you're going to sell the apparel that you just got or the majority of the apparel because i don't think he's got enough credits for you to sell all of them you will have an abundance of extra things every single time you run this if you don't sell them in this kind of like order so you want to go down to apparel i've got you see i've got these neuro tap marks which are like 900 credits which you're not going to be able to sell all the time we sell as much as we can to this guy until he runs out of credits so you know i could take i could sell one of these and just take the 267 
um, credits just just so that is emptied and I, I lose one of the marks. Now you can see that my credits have shot up dramatically. I haven't been doing it this way since I started so my my apparel has been stacking up. If you do this straight from the start and sell all your apparel to this shop first you're going to take less things in your inventory. Then we go into the trade authority shop and we speak to this guy here who often just never allows me to talk to him because he's in awkward positions. He has about 11,000 credits, so he has a little bit more. The rest of the apparels that you haven't sold yet, you want to sell to him. So I'm going to sell as much as I can. So I could, I've now only got one overlapping apparel that, you know, I before I had like 10 or 11 because I wasn't doing it properly. Now that you've sold all the apparel but one, then you want to go to this shop, which is the weapon shop, and sell all the weapons that you just got to this guy. And you can see that you are just racking up the, the credits. Um, the weapons are a little bit more expensive, but you won't waste all, like, you won't get all of his credits. You just get what it's worth. Now, with that being said, um, I have now got a whole bunch of credits in a very short time. Let me have a look. 250,000 credits. I've been doing this for less than half an hour and i'm at 250,000. and take into consideration that i have been um, recording as well next up you need to replenish those and this is a bit of the boring part so you want to go and sit on this bench and you're going to wait in total 48 hours so you want to stack up 24 hours and wait when this runs out you do it again for another 24 hours and then i'll show you what to do then when the 48 hours are up you want to run to these vendors and talk to them and that will allow you to replenish their inventory so when you go to do this again they will have stuff for you to steal if you don't talk to them their chests will be empty so this guy here you talk to him and go into his inventory and that guy there which um i'll show you very briefly by going into inventory i mean going into this section here once you see that they've got credits on them and weapons and ammo and stuff then you want to run back to the start and do it all over again so this is the other guy here do it to him too now i'm going to do it again and we're going to see exactly how much credits i make from this at the moment i got 251,688. let's go get those chests one thing I will say is just be very careful when you're going for this chest because you can drop all the way down and if you miss all of the things you can land on you just teleport back up into the game and you'll have to start again. You just got to very slowly creep to this corner and you see you might fall off. If you do fall off make sure you land here, get a full boost and go back up to this section. So when you have a full boost if you've fallen off go into one of these corners look straight up and you see this line that's going across that's where you kind of want to aim for and then you can go back up grab on and you're back up to where the chest is right there's one chest and then we can do this one we oh god no right and we've both chests done let's um let's go sell and see how much we get all right again we sell as much apparel to this guy as we possibly can um, get rid of you get rid of you get rid of you get rid of you as well get rid of you and i'm not willing to sacrifice i think for 69 credits let's go to the next shop right he has got the 11,000 credits so hopefully we can sell all this to him i did not mean to sell any of that but i can now also sell one of the weapons that i couldn't sell last time because now now i'm ahead of myself so i'll be able to always constantly now never have to carry anything that i don't need to then we could go to the weapon shop and do the same thing there. So we had 251,000. Now we've got 279,000. Obviously, some of the money fluctuates. So you're looking at at least 25,000 every less than five minutes, really depending on how efficient you are. On PC, it's going to be quicker because the loading screens of going in and out of the shop and just a general better control over where you're jumping and what you're doing. Bare, bare minimum, you will get 300,000 credits an hour. You're very easily get 500k if you know what you're doing and you do it really fast and efficiently and i think if you're super good you could probably get close to about 600k an hour which is insane do this for a couple of hours you got enough credits to last you for a very very long time in this game so very very useful i hope it helped hit the like button if it did leave a comment down below subscribe to the channel subscribe to my channel which i'll link down below and all of that fun youtube stuff so thank you for watching i've been easy now you guys have been awesome